Hello, I'm Tom Stiles and this is Tom's Radio Room Show and we're back out in our workshop. It's still in the 50s out here, but I'm out here anyway. And what I'm doing is, since I took that broomstick antenna partially apart, took the end of it off and I moved some wires around, I wanted to make sure that at this point that I didn't fix anything. It's kind of backwards. You'd think I'd want to make sure that I fixed it, but I'm just thinking that possibly I disturbed something and now it's working and I wanted to find out now before I disturb anything else. So I'm out here in my workshop. I got the antenna back up in the air, hooked up to the coax cable and coming in to my Grundig radio here. And we're going to tune to 15 megahertz WWV because it's in the afternoon here in Florida. And we'll see if uh, all of a sudden the antenna is working. So here we go. It's probably be a short video because it's probably not working yet. So anyway, here we go. Turn the radio on. WWV. Coming in good. Unfortunately, that's the internal antenna. That's the external antenna. Just as before, there's nothing, absolutely nothing. Um, and as before, the only time I got any improvement with the external antenna, and actually it wasn't an improvement, it was kind of equal to the internal, is when I took the um, shielded part of the connector loose and just used the internal part of the connector and um, so and then what it was doing it was just that that in part of in the the inner part of the uh, shielded cable was just acting as an antenna because I did a test where I took the broomstick antenna off and I did the same test with only the center pin connected to the radio and it behaved the same so the radio I mean the antenna was basically doing nada and it's still doing nada this is with the external antenna and this is internal so so far we have not made any progress the next thing I said I was going to do after I did this little test is I was going to take the connector out of the PVC, back it out of the PVC so that I can see the back of the connector to see if there is a good connection. So that's what I'm going to try next, a little more surgery, and we'll try that on the next show. So that's the show for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.